OpenAI just confirmed Orion, their next generation AI model, is almost here, and it's rumored to be a hundred times more powerful than GPT-4. Yes, you heard that right, 100 times more powerful. But here's the kicker. This isn't just another AI upgrade you'll see integrated into ChatGPT right away. Orion marks a new direction for OpenAI, rolling out gradually with selected partners instead of being launched to the public immediately. The stakes couldn't be higher. With promises of massive improvements in intelligence and performance, some say Orion might even bring us one step closer to Artificial General Intelligence AGI, where machines can think, learn, and reason like humans. But before we get carried away, let's break down the facts. What is Orion? How is it different? And why is OpenAI being so cautious about its release? What is Orion? How is it different from GPT-4? Orion is rumored to be a complete leap forward, not just an incremental improvement over GPT-4. While GPT-4 has already set new standards in natural language processing and human-like conversation, Orion aims to take things further with a level of reasoning and problem-solving capability that could rival human intelligence. The ambition behind Orion isn't just to build a better chatbot. It's about pushing toward AGI, an AI that can understand, plan, and innovate independently. But here's where things get interesting. Orion won't rely on traditional internet scraping for its knowledge base. Instead, OpenAI is shifting to synthetic data generation, using AI-created data to train Orion faster and more efficiently. This means the model won't be tied to the limitations of what's already available online, but can grow based on custom datasets. Internally, this process started with a model codenamed Strawberry, used to generate synthetic data as a foundation for Orion's development. This change in strategy could make Orion more accurate and scalable, but it also raises questions about transparency and accountability in how AI models learn. Exclusive Release Strategy – Why Orion Won't Be Public Right Away Unlike previous GPT releases, Orion won't immediately be available on ChatGPT for everyone to use. Instead, OpenAI is partnering with Microsoft to host Orion on the Azure platform for selected companies. These partners will get early access, using Orion to develop specialized applications across various industries. The goal? To test the model in controlled environments and ensure it works as expected before rolling it out to the public. OpenAI is playing it safe this time, likely to avoid the kinds of ethical and technical challenges that come with deploying such a powerful model to millions of users. Remember the backlash over GPT models generating biased or incorrect responses? By restricting access, OpenAI can refine Orion's behavior and manage potential risks before it hits a wider audience. This strategic move signals that OpenAI understands the potential risks of deploying an AI with 100 times the power of GPT-4, and they're not taking any chances. The power and potential of Orion. If Orion lives up to expectations, it could revolutionize multiple industries. In healthcare, it might go beyond diagnosing illness faster. Analyzing patient data to predict health risks and accelerating drug development by identifying patterns that humans can't easily spot. Business operations could be transformed as Orion automates complex decision-making, analyzing trends, and anticipating market changes in real life, helping companies stay ahead of disruptions and unlock new opportunities. Even creative industries could see a breakthrough, with AI generating music, art, and media that rivals human work, customized to audience preferences on demand. Orion is designed to push AI toward AGI, where machines don't just follow instructions, but reason, learn, and improve independently. This is a leap from automation to self-improving systems, capable of enhancing their own abilities without human input. If successful, Orion could become a model that creates its own solutions to challenges, paving the way for innovative breakthroughs across industries. However, this power also introduces risks. An AI capable of thinking for itself raises questions about control and accountability. Experts warn that if AI outgrows human oversight, managing its intelligence responsibly will become essential. While self-learning AI offers exciting possibilities, it also introduces the potential for unexpected outcomes. What if Orion's decisions conflict with human values or goals? This duality, unmatched potential alongside unpredictable risks, makes it clear that balancing progress with careful regulation will be critical. 
challenges behind the scenes, departures, and ethical issues. The development of Orion hasn't been without challenges. In fact, key leadership changes at OpenAI signal some turbulence. Notably, Mira Mirati, OpenAI's former CTO, and Miles Brundage, the AGI readiness advisor, left the company at critical moments. Brundage in particular expressed concerns that neither OpenAI nor the AI industry as a whole is prepared for the societal impact of AGI. His departure highlights the tension between pushing technological boundaries and ensuring the world is ready for them. Another thorny issue lies in copyright controversies. Former OpenAI researcher Suchir Balaji revealed that earlier AI models were trained by scrapping data from books, forums, and websites, sometimes without consent. This practice has landed OpenAI in legal hot water, with multiple lawsuits from authors and publishers accusing the company of violating copyright laws. While OpenAI has since struck deals with some publishers, these lawsuits underscore larger concerns about ethical data use in the AI space. Balaji himself warned that AI companies need better regulation, not only to protect creative industries, but also to prevent a reckless AI arms race. The AI arms race, competition with Anthropic and Amazon. The AI landscape is heating up, with Anthropic, founded by former OpenAI employees, emerging as a major competitor. Initially, Anthropic branded itself as the cautious alternative, prioritizing AI safety over rapid growth. However, with billions in funding from Amazon, the company has adopted a more aggressive approach. Their AI model, Claude, now competes directly with ChatGPT, signaling a shift from caution to active participation in the AI arms race. This change has intensified competition between Anthropic and OpenAI, leading to tensions between Sam Altman, OpenAI CEO, and Dario Amode, CEO of Anthropic. Altman remains focused on scaling Orion quickly, betting on rapid innovation to achieve AGI. In contrast, Amode urges a slower, more controlled approach, believing that safety must come first to avoid unintended consequences. Both companies share the same long-term goal, bringing us closer to AGI, but their strategies diverge sharply, reflecting different views on how to balance progress with responsibility. This psychological divide highlights a key debate. How fast is too fast when developing AI with such transformative potential? On one side, rapid advancement could unlock groundbreaking capabilities sooner, giving society a powerful edge. On the other, moving too quickly without sufficient safeguards could lead to unpredictable risks, not just for companies, but for the world at large. The vision of the future, what Orion could mean for society. Orion's potential to reshape industries is massive, but its impact on society could be even more profound. If AI models like Orion continue to advance, they could lead to a future where work becomes optional. Miles Brundage floated the idea of AI driving such economic growth that early retirement could be the norm. Imagine a world where AI handles the bulk of labor, allowing humans to focus on creativity, leisure, and personal growth. However, not everyone is optimistic about this future. Brundage also warned that society may not be ready for such a dramatic shift. If governments and organizations don't plan carefully, AI could disrupt economies and create social unrest. Many industries, from manufacturing to services, could see jobs disappear overnight, leaving millions unprepared to transition to new roles. There's a real risk that, without careful management, AI could lead to stagnation rather than progress. Orion's development isn't just about technology, it's about making sure society can adapt to the changes it brings. Are we really ready for what's coming? At the end of the day, Orion isn't just another AI release. It's a bold attempt to push the boundaries of what artificial intelligence can do. With promises of superhuman reasoning, synthetic data generation, and AGI, Orion has the potential to change everything, from healthcare to education, from businesses to entertainment. But as exciting as these possibilities sound, the risks are just as real. From leadership challenges and legal hurdles to economic disruptions and job displacement, Orion brings with it a set of questions we need to confront sooner rather than later. OpenAI's decision to roll out Orion cautiously, partnering with Microsoft and limiting early access, is a sign that they understand the stakes. But even with these precautions, there's no guarantee that the world is ready for what Orion represents. We're standing on the edge of a technological revolution. 
and what happens next could reshape society in ways we can't fully predict. So, the real question is, are we ready? Whether Orion becomes the tool that unlocks humanity's potential, or a force that throws the world into chaos depends not just on OpenAI, but on how we manage this transition. What do you think? Will Orion be the breakthrough we've all been waiting for, or a challenge we're not prepared to face? If you've made it this far, let us know what you think in the comments section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.